Welcome back to the garage and welcome to Shed Tune. Big thanks to the people who commented on the video last time, especially to the guy that mentioned about connecting the battery to the scooter. Uh, the only reason I didn't is I didn't have a battery to hand, so I've been out and got one, got some leads made up, and we'll connect it to the scooter so we can power the, the SIP Speedo, and then I'll show you how to set it up. So I've got myself a battery. I've made up a negative lead, which is going up to my earth on the scooter. I've got a positive lead, which is not connected to anything at the moment, but it's going to be connected to this lead, which would be the brown wire. Once I've powered that, that will then power up the speedo and we can work on it. Right, so that's the speedo powered up by the battery. You can now start your adjustments. If you hold the button for three seconds, it will take you into the main menu. There you go. So there's eight sections in the main menu and then sub menus in all of the sections. So I'll just show you number one. So if you hold it for three seconds more, there you go. It's got the first adjustment. Three seconds more again. Second adjustment. Three seconds more again. Next adjustment. Three seconds more again. And it goes back into the main menu. You can then flick through all the menus, in turn setting them up to what you want to have on your speedo. Okay, so I've set mine already. So we'll just flick through to number eight, which is the last one, then it go back to normal. Thanks for watching. If you liked what you saw, please give me a subscribe and maybe a thumbs up and leave a comment. See what experiences you've had with SIP Speedos.